If you remember in the last video, we were uh, making this, this plastic part that we put recesses on both sides, and we used a core in here. We printed it, put, print it partially, put in the core, and printed the rest of it, and we have, we have a really nice recess. And it picked up the, the uh, uh, texture from the core. So it works really great. But this piece is really, when it's put together, it's actually two pieces. And uh, we've got this uh, piece of acrylic over the top. But the thought was, why couldn't we make this, uh, 3D print this as one piece? In other words, print it such that the core is actually inside. And we print everything. And um, thus... Uh, save some assembly. So what we did, I'm going to try it out here, and it actually worked. This is the core I use, and again it's got the textured and actually fit in there. And uh, we printed it from the bottom up, this printed first, we set the core in there and printed around it. It's pretty remarkable. It made a a nice recess. So we started off with a with AutoCAD, or, or I'm sorry, <laughs> AutoCAD, with a Fusion, and uh, redesigned the core a little bit. You notice there's a there's a recess in here. The recess gives me a little more flexibility when it's time to remove this thing because this the plastic's all around this thing is pretty difficult can be pretty difficult to get out. And when I first tried one of those other cores, I really had a hard time with it. So <clears throat> this should help us quite a bit. Um, and um, then of course, uh, this was laid out in, in Fusion as well. The top part was put on. Uh, essentially used the artwork from here, but I extended it out because I didn't want that overhang here that would give us problems. But as you can see, we can slide a RFID card in there. It works just fine. So uh, let's go ahead and see how this works out. I'm gonna, we'll, we'll try this in the printer and print around it and see what happens. Okay, so as you can see here, let's set this in, in there. We've got all this printed. This will be the face of it. And uh, set this in place. A little bit of tape, again, to keep it from sliding. Just don't want it to slide. Fits nicely. Um, you can notice that this core is a little longer than the other one. It gives me a better chance of being able to pull it out of here once this whole thing is machined. But anyway, let's go ahead and, and uh, continue from the pause. And uh, we'll let it heat up and run. Move this out of the way, cause problems. It looks like it's doing fine. Go ahead and let it finish this this part of the build, and we'll come back and look at it after we get done. All right, we've got this out of the printer now. I've removed this, the core already. <laughs> it's not easy. Um, what I did is I used this device, a little uh, scraper, and I was able to get underneath here and, and loosen things up a bit. And then here on this end too. Now after that, I set the, uh, <clears throat> the thing on, a, on an edge, like on a table edge, you can see this, set it down, and then I hit the top with a <laughs> screwdriver handle. Probably more sophisticated ways of doing that. And it knocked it loose so it wasn't secured anymore. And then I was able to remove it. You can see it's still pretty tight. 
However, it does leave some really clean overhangs in this area, and this is actually through. I mean, it goes all the way through and nice square edges. So it's interesting. It's, uh, it's an experimental process. Here's a card. It slides in there like that. Um, I don't. I don't think I would replace this with this technique, mainly because this just looks nicer, I think. But this could be useful for other processes. Like I said, this is an experimental process, and uh, you'll have to play with it a little bit. But uh, it's an interesting way of of uh, achieving what we need to do here. Anyway, I hope this is really helpful uh, to you. If you got any questions or comments, uh, certainly uh, leave them in the comment section. And uh, have fun with this process. Anyway, thanks a lot for watching.